In a back garden in Leamington Spa, an experiment is underway, creating the beehive of the future. Um, the idea is to help the bees um, so that they've got less of a job and also to help the production of honey so we get more honey. The aim is to replace traditional beehive frames with something very different. This is a traditional frame from a beehive and as you can see the bees have built up a uh, wax honeycomb on top of it and that's where they're going to store the honey. But all of that takes a lot of energy and effort from the bees themselves. With the new 3D printed frame, they don't have to do that because it's all already been done for them. This is ready for the bees to fill each cell with honey. The frames were 3D printed by a team from WMG based at the University of Warwick. At WMG we have a network of manufacturers that are based in the UK, even in the West Midlands. So we'd like to um, link up with those and get these to market as soon as possible. That's of course if it works. I asked Peter's fellow beekeeper and other half if she thought the bees will take to their new home. I don't see why not. I think they will like it, um, but it's we'll have to see. I really don't know. I hope they do because obviously there's a lot of work being put into this, um, but who can tell? Nature's nature, isn't it? So they either will or they won't. And it does all beg the question why no one has tried this before. I don't know. That is a bit puzzling because I, I would have thought people would have wanted to have made things easier for their bees or maybe it's just they needed a fresh brain on it. As the weather warms up, will the bees warm up to their futuristic new home? We'll keep you posted. David Gregory Kumar, BBC Midlands Today, Lewington Spa.